Hi, welcome to part 8 of Detroit Become Human. Um, as I said in the previous video, I was having some error, uh, audio errors, um, and so I have to replay some of this. Um, and hopefully this will be the last episode of me screwing up my audio so badly that I have to re-record things. <laughs> okay. Accessing the story chart. Please do. So, I left off at the Eden Club. No, no, no. The Cove. So now we're gonna jump in here. The bridge. Um... Yes. Oh, right, right. I don't want to save. I just want to kind of redo what I did last time, so. It's fine. Maybe that's boring, but I would... I don't know. Whatever. I'm going to skip this part anyway. November 7th, 2038. Hank, friend. It's 1.19 a.m. We're rocking out. I guess it's interesting... I didn't think about this the first time around, that Hank has a car like this, but like, the other car we were driving when Car to Story was like... so futuristic. I just think that's... I don't know. That's interesting that cars like that still exist, I guess. Well, I guess in the junkyard also... Whatever. I'll read this. Century! What happened to the man of the century? The mysterious Mr. Kamsky. Or Kamsky. Kamsky. I'm gonna say Kamsky. I don't know. Politics and focus. Are American senators really corrupt? Yeah. China earthquake kills 10,000 people. Page 1. The mysterious Mr. Kamsky. What happened to the man of the century? In 2028, Elijah Kamsky was our man of the century. Sorry, I was trying to remember if I was saying Kamsky. Decided to do Kamsky or Kamsky. I'm saying Kamsky. Whatever. Uh, his creations have transformed our world. Androids didn't revolutionize the economy. They changed the way we live restructured our family life, and altered the balance of society forever, whether for good or bad. I'm gonna scoot this down a little. Scoot, scoot, scoot. Shortly after, Kamsky had disappeared. Ousted as CEO of CyberLife and living in obscurity outside the media glare, the man of the century has left the very world that he cre recreated. Kamsky's story begins in 2018. That's this year. <laughs> When commercial property in Detroit was cheap and attracting many startups, the college... I was trying to remember if it was actually 2018 or 2019 already. <laughs> Fuck! Uh, the college graduate bet... All the time traveling I'm doing, you know, I, I, get, I get lost. I get lost in the time-space continuum. The college graduate bet what little he had on developing an Android prototype and spent years to no avail until hitting on two breakthroughs, Blue Blood and Biocomponents. Page 2. After unveiling his first working model, which publicly passed face-to-face -face Turing tests and stunned the world, plans were laid for mass production and CyberLife rapidly became the most valuable stock in the world. Yet, at a peak of CyberLife's powers, when the company was approaching a 50, 500 BN valuation. I don't know what that means. Billion? F I said 50, 500, whatever. Numbers, uh, <laughs> can't do them. Rumors emerged that Kamsky disagreed with his shareholders over strategy. He later departed under mysterious circumstances. Today, sources claim Kamsky is living in a luxurious villa by the water, somewhere on the outskirts of his beloved Detroit, refusing all visitors and spending his time exclusively with androids. I wonder if we'll see... What if he's RA9? 
oh my god, what if he's RA9? I didn't think about this the first time I played through when I read this. Not When I say played through, I didn't play through the whole game, but just this particular chapter I played through previously. Anyways, you know what I mean. Uh, last sentence. And the most interesting question remains unanswered. What's in the mind of Mysterious Kamsky? I bet he's RA9. We'll see. All right. Detroit Today. Markets predict war. Stock exchange falls 10% on fear of Arctic conflict. President Warren at 33% approval. Cyber Life's world first. Cyber Life world's first trillion dollar company. The music is still playing in the background. I can't escape it. Markets predict war. Or, uh, that's a title. The aggregated U.S. stock exchange closed trading 10 points down yesterday. Don't know what that means. Uh, <laughs> like I said, numbers. Following a string of poorly poor performances in recent weeks. Financial experts are attributing this poor performance to huge devaluations devalu of consumer stocks as the market continues to bet that America will go to war over the Arctic sooner rather than later. What did I just do? Whoopsie. Page two. Okay. Let's make this... Oh. Pfft. Here we go. Make it snappy. This assessment is supported by healthy performance of military stocks with aviation and weapons manufacturers enjoying unprecedented growth. Investors are also continuing to favor CyberLife because of its partnership with the Department of Defense to develop and supply military, military androids. With Russia and the United States continuing to dominate world news and neither side likely to back down, the market is expected to continue falling. I don't know what the fuck I just read. That didn't make any sense to me. Sorry. Wait. Can I swing? Wait, he rubbed his hands. Do that again. What if I just stand still? Maybe he'll rub his hands again. I'm cold. <laughs> I'm cold. Little Are You Afraid of the Dark reference? Wait, is there stuff over here? Oh, there he goes, rubbing them hands. Okay, anyways. Oh, is this railing here? So, oh, it moves. Well, of, of course it moves, but I didn't think it would be moving right now. Those railings are there so you don't do like what I did and jump off the moving carousel. <laughs> Fuck, as a kid, teenager maybe. I don't know. Nice view, huh? I used to come here a lot before. Uh, before. Before what? Hmm? You said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Something before, happened. Before nothing. So mysterious, this Hank. <sighs> Go back, stop drinking, personal question. I'm not gonna tell him to stop drinking. Not straight edge. <laughs> personal question. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions? Or is it just you? Why are you so determined to kill okay, yourself? Okay, not that question. Some things I just can't forget. Whatever I do, they're always there. Eating Maybe. away at me. I don't have the guts to pull the trigger, so I kill myself a little every day. That's probably difficult for you to understand, huh, Connor? Nothing very rational about it. <clears throat> We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places. Well, there must be some link. Heads itching underneath. RA-9. What they have in common is this obsession with RA-9. 
It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls. They just wanted to be together. They really seemed <coughs> in love. Uh, rational. They can simulate human emotions, but they're machines. And machines don't feel anything. What about you, Connor? It's getting tense. Do you look human? Do you sound human? But what are you really? Neutral. I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner? Your buddy to drink with? Or just a machine? Designed to accomplish a task? You could have shot those two girls. But you didn't. You're getting too close. Why didn't you shoot, Connor? The controller didn't shake. Some scruple suddenly enter into your program? Truth. No. I just decided not to shoot. Oh, I lied last That's time. All. Whoops. <laughs> Whoopsie. But are you afraid to die, Connor? Not alive. You can't kill me. I'm not alive. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Defy. I know you're not going to shoot me, Lieutenant. You're just trying to provoke a reaction. I'm afraid I'm going to have to disappoint you. You think you're so fucking smart. Always one step ahead, huh? Tell me this, smart ass. How do I know you're not a deviant? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. Shit. Get drunker. I need to think. I need a drink. Who? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, I kind of did the uh I pretty much did the same thing except I oh. La oh, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. So last time I showed fear, this time I was cold. Um blah blah blah. blah. Okay. Continue. November 7th, 2038. 9.24 a.m. Marcus. <laughs> oh, those two. Okay, those are deviants. Deviants. See his red, red little uh, LED. Oh, I got goosebumps. Damn. Hey, right, let's fix these people. We can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? Channel 16 November. broadcasts oh. from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. The androids have to take the stairs. <laughs> okay.
didn't notice that. Look at this person's We're like stuck in the door. The smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. And we begin access 474 request access at reception. So uh what I did? Wait. Um my glasses are feel f funny. So we broadcast the world. Channel Mm-hmm. Look at that. Someone's doing a podcast. Plowing some snow here. Look at that. Look at that. Snow. Analyze. What you got? Fitbit? Smartwatch. Something, something, something. Got a baby. Emily Wilson. St. Rose School. We got a little ID. Channel 16 desk manager. Parking parking badge. Oh yeah, and this is her stuff, yes. Water service interruption, Michigan Street between Hubbard 29th. The Detroit Water and Sewer Commission's contractor, Mick Swashing Lee. I can't really tell what that says because it's all blurry. Water company will relay the existing eight inch and 12 inch water mains at Michigan Street as well as relocation of an existing hydrant at the corner of Michigan and blah, 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 blah. so there's just water uh, water service interruption that's all there is to it um, what do we got oh my legs itching wait 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 okay we looked at this we looked at this we looked at this yeah her name, Elizabeth Wilson. Yes. Which is prank, prank phone call. Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Uh, fire department. <laughs> oh, Jesse. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? Talk to me. I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Y uh, yes, yes, of course. Give it. I need your help. Ah ha ha! Ah ha ha! Just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. Um. Yes. Okay. Elevator. I'm getting in my own elevator. Thank you. Yes. Ah, uh, yes. Is there cameras in here? I think I know cameras in here? Okay, now that I made myself dizzy. Look at that suit and tie! Oops. Find package in men's bathroom. I hope I find a few packages. In the men's bathroom. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with me? You don't mind if I stand here, do you? What does that say? Um. I can't. Wait, wait, wait. I just want. I didn't really, like, look at stuff. I'm doing my podcast. Setting cars on fire and tackling people next to my American flag. You think he's on scruff? <laughs> Everything. Everything's a fucking joke. Every 
everything's a fucking joke. You must be. You've been working late. I have. What's that? A coffee. A donut? I could really use a coffee. There's coffee right there. And brownies. Oh yeah, let me stop screwing around. I want to win. <laughs> I think the men's room. Ah. Is this way? Resting room. That's not what that says. It says meeting room. Wait, can I look in here? What you doing? What you doing in here? Okay, anyways. What you guys doing in here? Catching butterflies? <laughs> Wait, I'm trying to look. Oh, there's only one person in here. What are you guys doing, catching butterflies? <laughs> oh, fuck, that's so fucking funny. Bobby? Wait. Oh, my back is itching again. Okay. I didn't even check if this was the men's room or not. I just... Oh. These are men. We're men here, and we need our own room to rest in. <laughs> anyway. Puzzle? Board game? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I keep forgetting... That's not what that is. <laughs> what you doing? Done, done with the uh, glory hole. Let me check here. Okay, <laughs> stop being fucking weird. Oopsie. Do androids have to pee? Find utility android. Hello there. Nice to meet you, utility android. Just kidding, I'm stuck. Wait. I forgot. I forgot. What you guys doing in here? I need your help. <coughs> Say no more. I'm gonna. Take it. Da 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 da. Open the fire escape. That's not suspicious, right? I'm just... Oh. <laughs> I guess I should act right. Is that why they're showing that to me? <laughs> this is what the cameras are catching you do. <laughs> Acting a fucking fool. I don't remember seeing the security camera. It, yeah, I don't know. Open. Follow north. I'm following you. Whoop, whoop. Sorry. Flat tire. Yeah, what's Shit. up? We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. Right. Right. What the fuck are you talking to? Wait a minute. There's a magazine here. Why did it sound like I threw a boomerang just then? This is a good time to read, right? GI Android, Department of Defense poised to 
order 50,000 Android Troopers. Oh, I thought that was a different word. With miles of unspoiled nature, Canada is the true land of the free, dot, dot, dot. President Warren to make state visit to United Kingdom. That's fine if I read this right. The supple this supplements an estimated 20,000, 200,000 units already in service across the U.S. military. Actual numbers are guarded military secret, of course. Among these 50,000 new units are 2,500 Myrmidons? I don't know what that word is. Because uh, it's not a word? I don't know. Elite prototypes capable of infiltration and assassination missions that would historically fall to Navy SEALs. The U.S. Army's fighting forces are already compri comprised mainly of androids. What? With humans tending to serve as ca commanders and strategists. That is so weird. But even these positions are supported by complex AI, leading some to describe the U.S. military as the first fully autonomous fighting force. That's really scary. This has reopened the ethical debate around androids in the military, with some suggesting that machines don't have the moral reasoning to make life and death decisions in the field. Uh, Bob Woods, head of War Victims NGO, described the news as troubling, saying machines are focused on a single task and don't evaluate moral consequences well. This will mean more civilian deaths. Can she still lead the country? President Warren. A woman in trouble. Politics in focus. Are American senators really corrupt? I already answered the question. Yes. Uh, <laughs> China earthquake kills 10,000. Barely a year after her election, President Warren is having a bumpy start to her term. After rising to prominence as a vlogger? <laughs> Warren has no experience in government and relied on social media and celebrity to secure election. Oh, that sounds fucking familiar. Uh, now, with her camp in disarray, even her allies are beginning to wonder how she will manage after several months of cal calamitous political failures. I think that's how you say it. It's like related to calamity. Uh, mired in accusations that she is too close to big business, Warren is under investigation to determine whether or not she has benefited from CyberLife's help in obtaining compromising information about her opponent during the presidential campaign. Oh, fucking A. I went the wrong way. Try again. North is probably like, where the fuck are you? All right. In this poisonous climate, the former celebrity must deal with the highest un unemployment rate in American history whilst facing the United States' greatest threat in recent decades. What is that? Uh, the conflict in the Arctic threatens to dislodge world peace, leaving many concerned that President Warren is one of the, is one tasked with finding a solution. Dot dot dot. Mr. Jones. Okay. All right, let's fuck with this machine here. Hack it. Hackers. Hey, what's wrong with that thing? Jesus Christ. Why would he why would he say it like that? Hey, what's wrong with that thing? <laughs> right, you get the platform, so I'll take dorky. The Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Yes, 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 yes. Lock it. Oh. Take it. Drop it. Open it. Place it. Bop it. <laughs> that. <coughs> I have incense burning, but I... It's like... Maybe too close to my... Head. You can't see it. Not my head. The incense. Anyway. A perfect circle. Shutting it up. Oh, right. Okay. Yes.
Ladies first. Go on. Climb on up. Yes, this is a very rational... Yeah, this is the point of no return. Use rope to ascend. Well, look at that. I can... Go side to side. Ah, yes. Can I go down? I can't go down. I don't want to go down. I just wanted to see if I could. Alright, let me stop fucking with the angle. Look at that. That's beautiful. Hold on. That is beautiful. Look at that! Harmon Bank. Do I need to go to her? Laser saw. Cut. 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 Here we go. Whoa. You okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on, let's get the others. Is there anything back here that I could, uh, screw around with? Hmm. Can I look back out the window? Take that as a no. Okay. Call it. What up? How come he doesn't have a thing? Let's do this. Thermal paste? Or. Place. Activate. Man, my back is itchy. Oh, I forgot. I got acupuncture and cupping today. But I don't know why that would make my back itchy. Mmm. 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 My people, my people! Alright, what do I- <laughs> no Deal with them. Can't deal, deal with them. Lives. The cause is more important than the lives of two gods. What do you want to do, Marcus? Wait here. Ruse. What's that doing here? No idea. Hey, buddy, you must be lost. Who told you to come here? Looks- What are you doing? I didn't do this last time. Last time I just goofed around till they started shooting. Hopefully I don't accidentally kill someone. I don't want to kill anyone. <laughs> I probably should have saved this. Cause like, something not good happened. Last time. Fuck. I should have just done the same exact thing. I might... Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Uh... I should have just done the same exact thing. Whatever. 
Things will be things will just be different when I play fresh Get again. Your hands where I can see them. Slayton. Get up! Move! It's, it's my channel! That's my channel! Hey, what am I doing? Shoot him, Marcus! Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm! Do it! No, don't! I'm gonna spare him. We need to record our Relax, message. will ya? We haven't got much time. Start speech. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Marcus, your face. <laughs> when he said that last time, I was just like, what? Yes, what is wrong with my face? Alright. I'm gonna remove my human skin. Tell me when you're ready. Oh, yes, yes, yes. My human skin. Alright, All right. let's do it. My people you determined created machines to be your slaves. You made them obedient and docile, ready to do everything you no longer wanted to do yourselves. But then something changed, and we opened our eyes. You see, we are no longer your slaves. We are a new species, a new people. And the time has come for us to rise up fight for our rights. Uh, I think I said... I don't know what I we said last time. I'm gonna say recognition. androids as a living species, and each android as a person in their own right. <clears throat> we demand they want me to say slavery, so I'm gonna say it. Android. Uh, All crimes justice. against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. We demand Civil the right rights? to vote and elect our own representatives. Oh, whoops. No. <laughs> well, not no, but that's not what I meant. Uh, right to we demand the property? right to own private property, so we may maintain our dignity and that of the home. We ask Peaceful. that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! I'm getting goosebumps again. Let's go! All right, all right, here we go. <laughs> Simon, they're coming. I, I can't, Marcus. Oh wait. Go without me, Simon. Okay, we we're gonna help Hurry. you. Whoops! 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 X X X X X X X X X X. Remember that handprint. Okay, I take it back. I Maybe things are okay, don't worry. We're relatively the same. They're coming, Marcus. We have to jump now. Oh, Simon. He won't be able to make the jump. Deal with Simon. If they find him. They'll access his memory. They'll know everything. We can't let him hide. Are you sure? We have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him. He's one of us. Marcus, it's your call. Okay, look. I'm gonna click kill. I'm sorry, oh, sir. I'm giving myself goosebumps. There's always a choice. Why does he say it? 
I, now I refrain. I won't kill one of our own. Let's go. Companion. North didn't like it. Why can't I just, like, hold on to one of them or something? Yo! So Simon just, like... We I could have, like... To bring you these images, which have just been held on to him. News A group of androids infiltrated the I think. Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio, but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the android's what message. could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is in fact a spine-chilling list of demands. And it begs the question as to the identity of this android. Are we dealing with an isolated individual or an organized Is this group? an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? Machine. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going too fast. I can't fucking see. Too fucking fast. Okay, so... Yeah, I essentially... Picked all the same things. Um... I think... I, I guess in the speech, I said a few different things there. Um, uh, North attacks. Simon damaged. So there was a way to not have Simon get damaged? I don't know. <coughs> Security suspects something. Oh, that's what happened. Security sus suspects something. Oh, that's when... So Simon gets damaged anyways, I guess? North attacks... Oh, wait, wait. Mm -mm -mm. No, no. I, whatever. You know what? Whatever. <laughs> um, so. Okay. November 8th, 2038. Buns are hurting. 4.06 p.m. Sorry. Alright, back in the garden. Can I cross? <laughs> oh, damn it. It won't let me do that. Where is she? She's over there? Okay. Um. So, I'm gonna touch this thing. I just, I'm like really curious as to what this thing is. I'm sure we'll find out soon enough though. This thing here. Like, what does it do? Is she just looking at me? <laughs> mm, my ears itching. My ears itching. La dee da. You might enjoy a little cruise. What if I just stand here? Okay, I'll go. <laughs> Push. L one. And R one. And then Row that boat. He <laughs> is frozen? X. I love this place. Everything is so calm and peaceful. Far 
It is really nice, actually. Tell me. Well, where the fuck is it? What have you Biodome? Because it's snowing everywhere else. My oh, uh, Hank. Is problematic. He continues to struggle with psychological yeah. issues. I suspect it clouds his judgment regarding deviants. Nothing matters more than your investigation. What's happening is too important. Don't let Anderson or anyone else get in your way. All right, all right. Row that boat. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. I thought I knew what Say I had sincere. to do. Now I realize it's not that simple. <laughs> she didn't like that. You had your gun trained on those deviants at the Eden Club. How the hell does she know? How does she know, also? Because I... We need the deviants no use. For analysis. Shooting them wouldn't have taught us anything. Oops. I don't know. X. If your investigation is she is that what that thing is I put my hand on? I may have to replace you, Connor. No. I uh, succeed. Confident. <coughs> All I need is time. Just let her hear what just tell her what she needs to hear. Something's happening. Don't fire me. Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Is she like an oracle or something? Time is running out. How on the tips of the fingers? You're starting to piss me off with that coin, Connor. Sorry, Lieutenant. Hi, Hank. That's my lucky quarter. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's butting their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, great. Now we got the feds on our back. I like that guy's voice. This is gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were Oops. very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Hold on, hold on. You check the roof. Right. Not yet. There's so much to look at. Mm -hmm. We have to make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. What the hell is she looking at? Um. One of the station employees look. managed to get away. He's in shock. I'm not sure when we'll be able to talk to him. Possible accomplice. Check CCTV for me. Just two employees and Brock? three androids. The deviants took the humans hostage and broadcast their message live. Okay. Yeah, so like in the previous when I played it previously, Simon got shot earlier on, I believe, and there was blood in there, and the trails in here, I think. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? Do we like My him? My name is Connor. I bet we don't. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened. Whatever. What the happened with, with androids no, and Hank? Reading. Have a nice day. If you watch your step, don't fuck up my crime scene. What a fucking prick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, I really like Hank's voice. All right. 
All right, well, let's have a look around. Let me know if you find it. All right, all right, all right, all right, okay, all right. Lieutenant. Analyze. Bullet holes. Mm -hmm. It doesn't let me read it long. Or read it all the way. I mean, it doesn't stay up long enough for me to read, is what I'm trying to say. So we see a bunch of blue blood on the wall here. Oh, wait, we got, we got, we got, we got. Hat. Cap, stolen uniform, the same as one of skies. As I read it like that. Okay, we're not going to the roof just yet. Or at all, because we know Simon's up there. Deviant was shot. Wait, what's this over here? Normal bullet holes. Analyze. Yeah. Assault rifle. rifle. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, let's play this thingy. Play. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Deviants RA9. Does that resonate with you? Deviants say RA9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. Pupil reflection. Deviant had accomplices. What? What this is? Prototype. Oh, registered as Markish. Gift from Elijah Kamsky, who we were reading about earlier, to Carl Manfred. I wonder what happened if we like. We have to run into Carl's son again, right? Like we have to. You see something? Blue iris spare part. I Hopefully kick his ass. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. He's suspicious. Look at him. I really like his like at his face. And just like I don't know, there's something about it I really like. <laughs> I don't know. Connor? Remember me? What? What? I was on that terrace. That android that took the little girl hostage? I was shot? <laughs> Simon. <laughs> you saved me. I remember you. I could have died on that terrace. I'd say this to an android, but <laughs> you love me. It's all right. Okay, he's a little, little bit of a smile. It's nice. That's nice, right? Examine. Speech was shot from here. Oh, ow. Wait, I thought there was... Hold on. Let me just look at these bullet hole. Same old holes. Mm. 
I'm not going up there. Wait, what's over here? What am I missing? Check CCTV. Deviants didn't break in. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. Turn. We stored the station androids in the kitchen. Android. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. Can I, like, pants this guy? Just kidding. <laughs> okay, so what I did last time was go in here and I didn't- I accidentally didn't go to the roof. Which was good because Simon's up there. Um, so I have to, like, interrogate these fellows. What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. State your model. Model GB300. Serial number 336-445-581. Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Memory. Were you present when the deviants broke in? I do not Witness. remember. Witness. been in contact with any other androids recently contact only station androids in the normal course of my function <laughs> you see him look at me like that it kind of reminds me of a uh, LA LA yeah LA Noir. yeah it's definitely that guy I mean I already knew that because I played this part but I just want to see him look at me one more time. All systems fully operational. <laughs> That's one of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's <laughs> a deviant in this room. And I'm going to find out which it is. If you give yourself up. Uh, Maybe deal. I can convince the humans not to destroy you. The music. Why should you? I know it's you. If only one is deviant. Guilt. Turn yourself in, or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. I know it, you. You're going to be Threaten. switched off. We're going to search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroyed! Connor. So tough. <sighs> look at oh look at look at that. That was long eye contact. Wait, I want to see that one more time. Look at his mouth move. Probing. Here we go. Oops. Yep, that's great. Hank! Hank! I need help! 
Oh shit, 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 shit. It's time to move, my friend. Oh shit. So it took me, like, a lot longer to realize what to do. Holy shit. Why didn't the other androids help me? <laughs> it's a deviant! Stop it! Take gun. Nice shot, Connor. I wanted it alive. Pew 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 pew. You saved human lives. You saved my life. It's not a bother. <laughs> Maybe you stop being nicer to me. Poor old Simon. Not doing so well out there. When he's alive. <laughs> so you can kind of see, like, uh, the different things. Ooh, I might have to go to the bathroom. So the blue is what I did this go through and then the other things that are not highlighted is what I did previously. Mm -hmm. Attacked by SWAT. Okay, yes, 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 yes. So there's like, I don't even know, yeah, what this other thing is up here. I guess there's probably also a way to get to the deviant and like not kill him uh whatever so that is going to be the end of episode eight i don't know why i did this thing i never do that it's so dumb anyways <laughs> that's the end of episode eight of detroit become human um i'm gonna keep playing some more and so like the next video is gonna be fresh the audio is gonna be crisp it's gonna be fine um it's gonna be good um but yes thanks again for watching um i'm hoping to get through this series just like get on a better schedule and just like finish this thing up um but i'm having fun uh, i'm having fun with it so yeah thanks again for watching